to be the problem. There's nothing specific written on your chart. Please call me Hank. Um, it's not a problem so much as a request. I'd like some blood. Excuse me? It's not for anything bad, I, I swear. I need it to live. I'm a vampire. I wouldn't ask, except I'm new in town. I don't have a supplier yet. Someone used to give you human blood? I had a buddy back home who was an embalmer. He could get my type anytime. I'm B negative. Mr. Moore, just, uh, Hank, how long have you felt this way? Oh, it's not something I feel or don't feel. It's just who I am. I see. So what happens if I don't give you any blood? Then I'll die by midnight. And I don't want to die. I don't want to hurt anybody either. But if you can't help, then I'll have to. Well, why don't you just wait here and I'll see what I can do to help you. Hey, Teddy Bear. You come to rub elbows with the king of rock and roll? Son, do you have any idea who I am? Well, actually, I would have... You are looking at a national monument. Mount Rushmore in blue suede shoes. There's not a human being on God's green earth that has ever demanded the attention and respect of the man you are looking at at this very moment. Hey, Bernie, some guy at the craft table says we'll give you five bucks to Goose's wife. I'll be right there. Well, my fans back in. I must go. Thank you very much. The fact that I have religious beliefs does not mean that I'm imposing them on my students. Well, you have. Kids want to convert, and one of them is mine. Hey, when we studied George Washington, they wanted wooden teeth. When we covered Ben Franklin, they wanted to go fly kites in the rain. These are young students getting excited about what they learn. <laughs> Next week, they'll probably want to become pilgrims. You're worried about my influence, hmm? Let's talk to one of my victims. My name is, uh, is Perry Breslow. I got a card. Yeah. Oh. I'm with the uh, Continental Life Insurance Agency. Yeah, I come in. Thank you. Dale, Dale's dead? Yeah, uh, shot himself. You know, pe people think that um, life insurance doesn't cover suicide. Well, that's only true if uh, the death occurs within two years of uh, initiating the policy. You know, in intent to defraud, that kind of thing. What's this got to do with myself? Well, it it's a funny thing how Mr. Westman uh, came into your life only to die six months later. Mr. Westman was a very disturbed man. I know. You're not Alex Connolly. Which one are you? <laughs> Welcome to our Congo room. Where all your jungle fantasies can come true. Uh, excuse me, I, I think there's been some mistake. No mistake, Major. Alva Bricker requested this room especially for you. It's her favorite. You don't say. Do you by any chance have another room? One with, uh, say, less foliage? Well, the Spanish Inquisition room is available. This will be fine. Good. Room service menus on the nightstand. The mini bar is fully stocked. In the bathroom, you'll find an ample supply of scents, oils, and body paint. <laughs> if you need anything, please let us know. I, I, I think that ought to hold us. John, there are probably hidden cameras in these bushes. Uh, video equipment is extra. <laughs> you can rent it at the front desk for $69.95. <laughs> Enjoy your stay. Yeah, you want to put that on? It'll save your uh, redness from burning out. Ah! Smut, food! It's the only reason I come out here. Well, it's one of the only reasons. Ah, uh, excuse me. It's got my name on it. 
Yeah. I think you're safe around the donuts. I gotta tell you, there is no show on earth like this one. Look, I came to the Better Business Bureau to put these people out of business. Look at this, this so-called home hair cutter. Look what it did to me. We'll contact the business, and if they don't respond, we'll put them on our warning list. Thank you. Don't worry, brother. We're going to get those bastards. <laughs> <laughs>